Have you ever wondered which of your parents would be more like you? Along with the other external features, I was curious which of the parents would inherit our brain power such as speed of thought process and memory. So I decided to research what substance that influenced our brain power would be inherited and we'll figure out whether it is inherited specifically from mom or dad. Let's begin with what's affecting our brain power to function. The activities in the brain are controlled by mitochondria, which supplies chemical energy called ATP for all of our cellular activities to function. However, among these, the brain such as neuron activities heavily rely on mitochondria and are the highest consumer of its energy by consuming more than 20%. In our brain and nerves, there is cell called neuron. Our thoughts and memory will form as neural communication operates, and mitochondria plays a significant role in maintaining its energy during its activity by providing ATP. Then, how does neural communication operate? The gap between two neurons, let's say where head axon terminal and buttor dendrite faces, are called synaptic clefts. By looking at this picture, you notice something's going on in between this gap. These particles are the messengers of signals called neurotransmitters, and they are released from axon terminals. When it is released, receptors on the right bind these neurotransmitters and convert its chemical signal messages into electrical signals. To restate simply, neurons are networking over synapses through neurotransmitters and mitochondria are powering this system. Additionally, mitochondria controls calcium ion concentration, which is another messenger that sends electrical signals among neurons and activates ionic channels to allow neurotransmitters to be released at the right timing. However, if calcium concentration goes too low or high, it will likely cause memory loss, or it can even cause Alzheimer's disease. However, you would inherit your mitochondria only from your mom. After fertilization, the mitochondria of the sperm cell is destroyed in the jargon. This prevents paternal leakage of the mitochondria to the offspring, which occurs when you inherit material that is supposed to be inherited only from one of the parents but got from both of the parents. If X cell don't destroy the mitochondria and the sperm cell, it will inherit two types of mitochondria DNA from both of the parents. And this mutation is called heteroplasmy, which can cause glucose intolerance to cancer depends on its degree. Thus, the conclusion of this video is that our brain power resembles mom as we inherit our mitochondria that empowers you to bring out thoughts and record past memories exclusively from your mom.